welcome to day three of Digital Fashion Week Singapore 2014. My name is Yvette King and I hope you guys are excited as I am for today's lineup. Oh, I think it's now bigger and better. There's just lots more to enjoy. since 1935 so you know we're the oldest tailoring company in Singapore um, so the idea was to try and reach the masses and also the younger generation. The inspiration behind is based on the words energy so we want to bring like a youthful energy towards the bespoke tailoring so then you will see like a, a current color which is like a touch of uh, beige or cream colors and then we have an orange color and we also have like turquoise color so that's very current and very fresh to bring into menswear and as well uh, women's wear. What is one key piece that every woman should have in their wardrobe season after season? I would normally say a great coat, but I'm not sure that works at this part of the hemisphere. You know, so I actually might say a great handbag or a really wonderful piece of jewellery, actually. I think accessories and the accessories in Singapore are really incredible. He has some incredible jewellery designers here. I think it's getting better year on year. This year, um, there seem to be way more organised, uh, more brands, more interesting brands coming over with the Thai Collective. We're really excited to see that, see what's happening in Bangkok. How easy it is, is it for you to pick the designers who showed today? Yeah, we have varies in terms of leading Thai designers and also the upcoming designers and also the students that already won the awards. So it's a mix between different groups of designers. Let's start shopping, shall we? Digital Fashion Week Singapore! We're kind of inspired by Lux Sports. So as much as Lux Sports, it's not supposed to look very sporty, so I kind of thought like if it's um, sportswear details and elements inspired, we kind of thought like, it would be nice to have a pop colour in it. And because when you think of like sportswear is dynamic, it's energetic, so this is how we have like all our, um, if you see the orange and the pink, those are our highlight colours. The polling lingo is someone who is eclectic, someone who is inquisitive, and definitely looking for items that are valuable instead of pieces that, are, that you can see like, all over the world. dress is quite practical here. I mean, some people, there are those brave souls in the street who do wear leather still. And I'm like, wow, props to you. Like, that's the fashionista. <laughs> we just designed very organically. Um, whatever we feel, you know, our relationship between the two of us, you know, whatever comes to us, we just express it's a bit like an expression. We designed this collection with sort of like the runway in mind. Yeah, so we wanted to create something more like a presentation, you know, something that people can feel because we just kind of feel that, you know, you can forget what a beautiful piece of garment looks like. And Ten years down the road, you won't forget you know, the kind of feeling that, you know, we gave you or we presented. You won't forget this sense of emotion and this overwhelming maybe a bit of fear, a bit, you know, the darkness of that collection, something that you will stay with you for a long time. There's a little bit more understanding of the women's side of the market. And of course, they very much fit that whole zeitgeist of that kind of street ninja, kind of sport goth thing that's going on at the moment, which is good for them too. We're going to say goodnight for day three. We'll see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow.